The Seaholm neighborhood of Bellingham is located at the base of Seaholm Hill, in between the downtown core and I-5. The main thoroughfares that run through the neighborhood are North Forest Street, North Garden Street, Billy Frank Jr. Street, East Chestnut Street, and Samish Way. Seaholm has multiple distinct residential areas, each with their own share of historical buildings with different styles, sizes, and ages, ranging from Victoria era mansions to craftsman style bungalows. Traveling down State Street past the roundabout will bring you face to face with many historical significant single family homes. Though these 19th century buildings are single family, there are many newer multifamily homes located along the boulevard where they have clear views of Bellingham Bay and convenient access to the South Bay Trail leading you to downtown and Boulevard Park. Most notably in this area, you will also find the Washington National Guard Armory. Built in 1910, the castle-like building remains one of the most significant historical features in the neighborhood, being treasured by both the city and the state. Moving north, passing the tucked away forest and cedar neighborhood park, you will enter into the second distinct residential area, which is characterized by its steep terrain being broken into a series of level benches of land allowing residents uninterrupted views of the bay and downtown core. Here you will find a mix of grand 19th century single family homes, historical multifamily apartment buildings, and many other historical significant religious, community, and commercial buildings. Settled in 1854, Seaholm was once its own town, separated from Bellingham until 1904. Supported by the Bellingham Coal Company, these houses were built by city founders as well as early industrialists and business people. Today, this area is part of the Seaholm Hill National Historic District. Seaholm has one of the highest population densities in Bellingham, with the majority of its residential units being multifamily. Children will attend either Lowell or Happy Valley Elementary Schools and later Fairhaven Middle School, then off to Seaholm High School. The residents in this neighborhood are in close proximity to multiple public spaces, parks, and trails. The Laurel Park and the Forest and Cedar Neighborhood Park each contain open lawns, playgrounds, hoops, and picnic areas. The residential area on the northeast side of Seaholm Hill is minutes away from the wooded trails that connect to the Seaholm Hill Arboretum, which then connects you to WW. Not only are these trails great for recreation, but students and faculty may discover more scenic commute to the university. The neighborhood also retains a fair share of commercial buildings. The Samish Way Urban Village not only contains a variety of restaurants, supermarkets, general merchandise, and specialty stores, but also serves as a gateway to Bellingham, connecting WW, Lake Padden, downtown, and the interstate. Seaholm is truly a one-of-a-kind neighborhood. It offers stunning buildings, each with their own rich history. Great access to all the best areas of Bellingham and a neighborhood feel like no other. Hey, it's Keith. This is one of the many neighborhood videos we created featuring each of the neighborhoods within the city limits of Bellingham. If you enjoyed this video, check out our channel as you might like our Bellingham and Beyond video series, which explores Bellingham and Whatcom County parks. We also have a real estate video series for those of you who may be interested. Additional information can be found at our website, www.buyermax.com. Thanks for watching.